Hi guys, today I want to show you how I painted my sexy cute pink half-face skull. I'm starting off using tag pink. This is the color of the base that I'm going to be using for my skull. I'm just painting a line across my face just to give me a guide of where the skull is going to be placed. Now using one of my paradise sponges, which these sponges are by far my favorite sponges of all time. You will always see me using these sponges. Now I'm just giving myself a nice even base. And if you're not getting paint all over your hands, then you're not doing it right. Oh yeah, I forgot, I'm also drinking some wine. Cheers guys. Now every skull needs some hollow cheeks, so that's exactly what I'm doing now. I'm just outlining where the hollows will be placed on my cheeks and I'm just gonna fill them right in using Wolf Black. Now I'm just painting on my skull's nose using the same Wolf Black. I'm just outlining exactly where my nose is gonna be placed and I'm just gonna be filling that in just like I did with my hollow cheeks. Now I wanted to continue with a really simple skull look. So for the teeth, using the same wolf black, I'm just gonna be pressing down on the brush and at the same time I'm lifting up, I'm releasing the brush. That's gonna give me exactly the look that I'm going for when it comes to my skull's teeth. Okay, now that I'm done with that, it's time for some wine break. Don't forget to use a straw so you don't mess up your teeth. From here on, I'm just gonna be shading using one of my Morphe palettes. I'm going to be using the darkest shade of pink, which is a hot pink. I'm gonna be shading the edge of the top of my skull, around the hollows of my cheeks, around my nose, in between my teeth, a little on my chin, just to give it more dimension and make my skull pop out more. Using the same hot pink that I used to shade my skull, I'm gonna be adding that eyeshadow to my eyes. Now I'm just adding this eyeshadow to the center of my eyelid and my lower lid. I think it's gonna look really cool once I put my white contacts in. It's gonna really make my contacts pop. So that's why I'm layering these, uh, this eyeshadow so it could look really hot pink. Using Wolf Black again, I'm gonna be outlining the top of my skull. I wanna add some black shading to my skull, so I figured this will look really cool. Now using the same blending brush I used for my eyes, I'm gonna be adding some black eyeshadow for blending. I'm gonna be shading the top line of my skull. I'm also gonna be shading around the hollows of my cheeks. I'm also gonna be adding some shade to the crease of my chin and just pretty much randomly adding black shade to wherever I feel will look cool. Let's not forget to highlight my skull. So I'm using a pearl white eyeshadow and with that I'm gonna be highlighting my chin, my cheekbones, and my jawline. Now my chest and neck was looking a little plain, so I decided to paint on some hearts going all the way up my chest, all the way up to my neck. Now, isn't this the easiest way to paint hearts? Who would have known, right? 
Using a silver liquid gel glitter, I'm gonna be adding a dot to each heart to make the heart stand out. I'm also gonna be outlining the top of my skull, around my nose, the hollows of my cheeks, and I'm also gonna be outlining my teeth with it. Once I'm done outlining my teeth, I'm also gonna be adding some glitter dots on top of my eyebrows to balance out the look. Now don't forget to put in your contacts and add your flowers to your hair. And that's it guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video.